Hi everybody, um, I'd like to share with you today my Angels of Atlantis Oracle cards. Um, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them out in uh, a set of three and the idea of these is that they act as tools for which people can actually communicate with the angels or the angels of Atlantis as some people have called them as, as you can tell by this name here. So in a minute what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle the angel cards and then I'm going to put them out in a set of three and the, we're going to sort of like go through them and see what messages they are. So let me just give you an example of what we're going to do today. Give them a shuffle. Ooh. Right, I've shuffled them. So what we're going to do, we're going to lay the first three down beside me and we're going to sort of like look at them and see what the messages are. Right, this first one is Abundance and it's from Archangel Uriel and this card is telling you that basically God is helping you with your, your sort of like your issues of abundance meaning the more you trust in God the more he can send help to you and the more he will provide for you as the saying goes, what you don't have, God will provide. And I basically feel that this here, the tree of life, is symbolising, you know, God's gift to us. You know, he's, he's like giving us, he's got, he's going, he can cater to all our needs and everything that we need is provided by God through the tree of life into us, his children. So that's something that I think is really, really interesting the, here. So I think what it's telling you is to sort of trust. And the more that you sort of like trust in God, the more the power of the powerful flow of abundance he'll be able to give to you or send to you. This middle one here is uh, Archangel Gabriel. And it's called inspirate. The message here is inspiration. So we've had abundance and now inspiration. And again, inspiration is, is sort of like there reminding you that Archangel Gabriel's great white light is around you and that he can send you inspiration for anything that you need. It might be a writing project or it could be anything that you really, anything that you want you know, that you feel inspired to do. If you feel a lack of inspiration in your life, contact Archangel Gabriel through prayer, through God, and he can come to you and he can help you with this, with in empowering or opening up your the side of you that is full of inspiration and creative ideas. So Archangel Gabriel... It's sort of like behind creativity and he can inspire you to work in very creative ways in whatever project you're up to, you want to work on. So that's the middle one. So we've had abundance, inspiration. Now the final one. Da -da 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 -da. Archangel Metatron. Right, miracles. Now... We know life itself is a miracle and this and Metatron is behind the is the archangel if you like who is behind miracles and granting them into our life. So it's also perhaps telling people here to look for the miracles in your everyday life. Look for like the inspir look for the things that you have deemed miraculous, big and small. And, you know, eventually 
you'll soon notice that the miracles will reveal themselves to you. I mean, miracles can be like the birth of a child, the, you know, looking at nature. It, it, in at some point or another, we're all we're all totally we see the miracles, but we don't always notice them. So Archangel Metatron is telling us to look at the miracles that are surround us every day, the miracles that happen every day. And I think also, I'll turn these round for you so the camera can see them a lot more. I also feel that miracles, Metatron can help bring miracles into your life. And again, it's to do with trust and just letting, just allowing the the love of these great beings and what they can do to come into your life. It's it's all about all three of these cards are to do with trust and just allowing to go with the flow and letting the creative energy that's around us, the divine energy, if you will. So yeah, so they're the messages and the basic meanings of the cards. So, I hope that answers a lot of questions. Um, I want to thank you all for sort of like coming to watch this video. And uh, if you have any questions, please email me. And uh, I sort of like, I can, you know, hopefully answer anything that you want to, that you have, any questions that you have. Alright then, God bless you all and thank you for watching this video. Bye for now, love and light.